Welcome. I'm from the Lenovo Tab P11, and today I'll show you how to transfer files from the device to a SD card and vice versa. So if we get started, we'll want to open up the files application. Okay, there is one. So open it up. Let's allow whatever it wants. And from here, you want to scroll down where you should find your two storages. So SD card and the tablet itself. Now we'll start with the tablet and go over two or three folders that I consider to be important. Uh, assuming you don't know where your files might be located. So starting off, number one would be the DCIM folder, which will contain pictures uh, and videos captured with the device. Now, for me, those are empty. Then we have the downloads folder, which contains anything that I have downloaded, apps, photos, uh, documents, they all will get saved here. And lastly, at the bottom, we have pictures folder, which contains screenshots. As you can see, there's a couple of them here. So anyway, once you find your files, which I will be using those screenshots as an example, what you want to do is select them. And you do so by simply holding one of them you can see it changes entirely, gives you this check mark, and then you can tap on additional ones to select them quickly. So once you have selected your files, click on the three dots right here and choose one of the two options. So you can either move them or copy them. The choice is yours. I'll go with a move option. Once you select one of those, you will always get this pop-up at the bottom. So it will ask you where to copy or move them to. And you can change the location on your tablet, which is where we are right now. That's why it gives you the internal uh, storage. Or you can move it to a completely different storage like the SD card, which is what I will be selecting. Now the SD card has virtually the same folders as you can see right here. The difference is those are empty. Um, so from here, you can navigate to a specific folder where you want to drop those files or you can just drop them straight right here without actually navigating into any folder. Or you could actually create one right here if you want to create a new folder uh, that doesn't exist yet. Now, I won't bother with creating any folder or moving it into a specific one. I'm just going to drop it right to here. Let's continue. I use this folder and allow. And there we go. As you can see, uh, three of them disappeared. And if I go to SD card, should be right at the bottom and there they are and that is how you could move any kind of file from one location to another now if you found this very helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching